So I'm out today again, uh, just uh, building some more sets. Uh, what I'm doing here, I have a set under that log right there. It's basically just kind of a cubby. And then right over there in the trees is where I built that flip up snare. Uh, I don't know, it's probably 50 yards back in there. And there's a trail that comes down that in the summer grows all in with grass and everything else. And it gets used by some deer and stuff. But what I'm doing today is just walking down it, uh, spraying it behind me. And that way it kind of stays as a main thoroughfare and I can set stuff all along this trail. I'm going to do this on a couple other ones. I got trails on up higher up up the hill here, which we'll go up there and um, do a couple other things too. So anyway, that's uh, what's on the agenda for today. So next on uh, the agenda is a bait station. Uh, I didn't have one last year and I'm going to basically use this area right here to create a little better trail up through here and there's upturned stump a couple trees that are cut off some logs Probably a little hard to see here but uh, we'll get it built and show you what I came up with and uh, hopefully this will work out pretty good because it's pretty close to the road so it's easy to pack stuff into and it's also right on this road that runs right along the top of the, the ridge here so she'll get some traffic. Uh, I'll get her built and see what she looks like. So I've got her all put together. Um, I'm doing this, this is from the, the back part of it. Uh, what I'm trying to do here is make it so there's just one entry in under that log. I'll show this from the other side here in a second. Um, I'm going to spray all the foliage coming in to make a real clear path in. Um, and then what I'm going to do is there's a trail behind it too. I oh, can't see it real good because it's pretty thick, but I'm going to spray this and then right between that scotch room and that little dug fur, um, I'll put a leg hold trap for stuff coming around behind it. We can't uh, have leg hold traps within 15 feet of any sight bait, so I'll put a snare at the, the entry up front, but I'll do a couple leg holds, so let me wander around here the front and I'll show you the front. So this is the front, like I said, I'll spray this trail in. Um, it'll end up just with a uh, path through right down there, and we can use snares uh, with, with sight bait, so I'll have just one snare there. And I'm also going to do another uh, foothold down there. There's a little path that runs along this road, and that way if there's any coyotes or anything that we're too nervous to go in, I may just get them passing by. So anyway, um, grab that sprayer, and then I'll be off to the next one. Okay, so I'm back from uh, setting up a few uh, sets today and give you a little sneak peek of something else I got going on. i um, got five pigs that I will be doing a whole series of basically raising them from piglets all the way until making bacon and hams and sausages and all that good stuff. So uh, it's coming up in the fall, probably November is when I'll be butchering them. Um, but uh, they're cruising right along and they're... I just got some fresh greens and out enjoying the cool day. So, anyway, as always, thanks for watching. Um, if you have any comments, feel free to leave them. Have a good one.